Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to talk about visual effects in Twinmotion. Let's get started. Adding visual effects to an image or a video is easy with Twinmotion. This works like Instagram, where you take a picture and you'll be able to add filter to make the image more interesting. The good thing about this is it is easy to apply and to choose from. And it saves you time by applying different exposure, white balance, shadows, contrast, and saturation. On top of that, you can also change the set settings while on a visual effects. So I have my scene here. And you can either go to settings or those individual image or video to set this visual effect. So if you do it under settings, you have to go to settings, camera, and then visual effects. And then you could go to color gradient and then choose from all of this type. So the non is will be like this. You can choose ANSO, Copper, ISM, those kind of stuff. But once you set it on this setting, it will be applied on all images that you created and all the videos as well. So for, for me, for now, I just want it to be set individually so that we could I could show you the differences. So under image, I'm going to create an image here. And then click more. Go to camera. Visual effects. And then color gradient. So now we have we don't have any. So this one, I want to choose copper first. Let's go back to media or image. And then let's create another one. Click more again. Camera, visual effects, color gradient. And let's choose ISM. And right there, you can see the difference between copper and ISM. If you scroll down, there's more. Like they have black and white, DTC. MTX and a lot more. So for this example, let's stick to ISM first. And on top of that, like I said earlier, earlier, you can change the contrast and the saturation with the type of visual effects that you chosen. And then with that, you can add vignetting. And then under lighting, you can add change the exposure and white balance. And you can be able to play around with all the settings. So for me, I sometimes cho choose uh, copper or ISM and then work my way around and change all the settings. And it's actually a lot faster for me to just choose on those different pre-build filters that Twinmotion has. Thank you for watching and I hope you liked the video. Please hit like and subscribe. Feel free to comment down below.